Hey, what's up? Coach Ryan here from the Viper Pit. Today I'm going to give you the step-by-step -step secret to adding 100 pounds to your bench press instantly. Ready to get started? Step one, bench press to failure three times a week for six to eight years. Accumulate many injuries, but no real progress outside of the initial beginner gains. Step two, spend hours at a time on Google searching for shortcuts to improve your bench press. Find 10 million tips and shortcuts from people who will never have any bench press their own body weight. While on Google, check to see if pizza delivery from Jones is a real thing yet. It's not, so go ahead and order your pizza the old-fashioned way. Step three, hire a real expert to write your bench press programs for you. Make the first real progress you've ever made in your life. Step five, believe that you now know better than the person that actually helped you make progress and go back to making your own programs. Blend together your old workouts with the ones that your expert coach gave you. Stay on this plateau for three to six years. Make sure you mutter, this should be working under your breath after every missed attempt. Optional step six. Decide that you really need to step things up and simultaneously express your training creativity. Write a ridiculously impossible bench press cycle and proceed to blow your pec major tendon off of your humerus. Enjoy the feeling of having a single D cup that feels just like a real boob. But don't squeeze it, that freaking hurts. Mandatory step seven if you completed step six. Get surgery on your pec. Spend the better part of the next year returning to your prepubescent strength levels. Relive sixth grade gym class all over again, trying to avoid the overdeveloped eighth grader who's been held back three times, has a driver's license, a prom date, and a beard. He's freaking mean. Step eight, once back to your pre-injury strength levels, get smart again, hire another expert to write your programs. Make sure to let this expert know all the things that the other expert did and that you think he should make you a program based on the other expert's principles. Get fired from this expert because you're a know-it-all punk who can't follow instruction. Then, make sure to go on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, Grindr, wait, maybe not Grindr, and post about what a terrible and unqualified coach he is. Step nine, by this point, you're about 15 years into your strength journey, and your bench press will have instantly increased by 100 pounds, just by default. Now, I made this post to be a little bit funny. I'm no comedian. Uh, by trade, so please don't be too harsh on me in the comments, but in all seriousness, I want to outline the fact that you should generally click away from headlines like the one that I got you in this video. I know, I tricked you, I'm sorry, but no, I'm not sorry because you need to hear this if you actually thought that I could add 100 pounds to your bench press instantly, okay? You know, looking for a shortcut is very rarely the best way to go, and you're going to miss out on the best part of improving yourself, the journey to getting better learning from your mistakes, hearing what other more qualified people have to say about your progress and how they can help you, dusting yourself off when you fall, overcoming the feeling of hopelessness that you'll never reach your goal. I promise you that 500 pound bench press or 300 pound or 95 pound, etc., will be much more rewarding if you had to work hard for it, rebound from poor decisions and spend time slaving away at your craft than it would be if you were just handed to you on an instant tip. This goes for fat loss, muscle gain, strength building, sports performance, financial management, careers, relationships, nearly anything in life is more rewarding if you forget about the shortcuts and focus on putting in the work. I hope you took something away from this video today. Uh, I'm Coach Ryan Family, and your homework assignment is to share this video with at least one person that needs to hear it. Talk to you soon.